I'm Chip Means. I'm at the Hippocrates booth at HIMSS 10. Today I'm going to speak with Jeffrey Rutledge, who's the Chief Medical Officer for Product Development and an Emergency Physician. We now have the majority of the Hippocrates and, uh, users' physicians using the iPhone. Overall, we have now 275,000 U.S. physicians who are actively using the uh, application, uh, launching the application, updating it with uh, the continuously updated uh, prescription database that we have. The big announcement uh, the, uh, for the HIMSS conference this year, for the first time we've been announcing our commitment uh, to creating a fully functioning electronic health record. We have committed to deploying this uh, application uh, before the end of the year. The application will leverage what we are our strengths in terms of understanding what physicians need at the point of care. Our application has a fully featured mobile uh, running on the iPhone an application that the docs can use in practice and it's fully integrated with a comprehensive and fully featured electronic health record that runs uh, on a web service on so the desktop with a keyboard and, uh, and mouse. Uh, the fully featured EMR is there and integrates with the and, and so, are you developing the, the EHR as a proprietary solution that will integrate with, with the app, or is it, is, is it going to be that the app will now have interfacing capabilities with other EMRs as well? Our electronic health record is a standalone, comprehensive, uh, fully featured application that physicians uh, will use in their office. The application is aimed and targeted at the small and solo and small group uh, practice segment. We think this is a terribly underserved segment. We think that the previous applications have been very complex, hard to implement, hard to support, and uh, difficult to use. Uh, let's talk quickly about the iPad, uh, because that's the new sort of hot uh, tablet-sized technology, and, and everyone's wondering how it'll be used in the clinical setting. Um, can you give me a sense of, the, of what you may have planned for that, and how, how you're going to take advantage of the size and shape of that I'm also very excited about the iPad. We've announced our commitment to developing a fully featured application on the iPad. The first step for us will be deploying our core uh, reference application on the iPad. But we're very interested in how this will work in the office settings. I personally believe that the iPad will find great use and utility by physicians at the point of care. The iPad is a tablet that's kind of analogous to a patient chart, the clipboard. Whereas the iPhone is more of analogous to either the prescription pad that sits in the pocket or the Sanford guide that's uh, in the other pocket, uh, whereas the tablet is like the, uh, the patient chart. And so the iPad will, uh, will, it will not be in our first release this year, but we will support the iPad as a uh, platform for delivering the application uh, in the office of point of care. So you see we, have, we are supporting the uh, core uh, application across multiple platforms from Android to uh, the iPhone, the new uh, release actually of our Palm Pre application. It runs on the original uh, trios and of course we also support the uh, BlackBerry. Uh, what's not shown here is the Windows uh, Mobile which is also supported. Okay, great.